Okay, today what we have is the Henry Survival Rifle. Now, this one is a compact 16 and a half inches. Everything fits into the stock of it. This is an older version, so it is the Mossy Breakup. Uh, nowadays, uh, they come in uh, a different type of camouflage. They make these in three versions. You have the camouflage one, silver, and black. It weighs 2 pounds, 12 ounces, so it is a nice, light, compact model. So let's open it up and uh, take a look inside. They say it floats, but uh, I'm not going to throw it in the water to find out. Because what you do is you have a ring around here where this rubber seal goes in, and it's to uh, keep the water out. So what we have is we have the trigger, bolt, and magazine. We have an extra seven round magazine. And then we have a 16 inch barrel that does have iron sights. Now this is a steel sleeve. I don't know if you can see that. And then it's wrapped in nylon to keep the weight down. So what we have is uh, there is a little lever here that you push and that lets your magazine come out. This is our safety. And our bolt and our charging handle I should say slips down in so you have to pull it out in order to cock it. Now if you notice it does have peep sight built into the back of it. Uh, which you can do a small hole or you can loosen this screw up, slide it down, and it becomes a larger hole. It does have a rail system on it so that you can mount a scope. The only thing was is they didn't make anywhere in the handle of the gun stock to put the scope. So if you take a scope with you in a survival situation, you're going to have to carry it extra because it's won't actually fit in here. All right, so let's put the gun together. We want to put this back in. It snaps in place. We take this, we slide it in, and then there's a knob on the back here. We just turn it. There's a little T here, as you can see, that goes into the slot. And then you just crank it down. Like I said, it's it's a nice compact little rifle after it's put together here. Uh, I don't know if I can pan out far enough that you could see that or not. Uh, it is a good survival rifle, but if anybody's ever watched any of my videos, I don't like semi-automatics for survival situations. You have too many moving parts, too many things could go wrong. Uh, but if uh, weight and space is a factor so that you cannot carry a bolt action, then this would be one of your best alternatives. Like I said, because it is small, it's lightweight, and we will get the job done. All right. Now, let me show you something that I've kind of improved on with this particular model. Uh, because, you know, in a survival situation, you're going to need all the advantages that you can get. So, as you can see, it won't go in unless I push the charging handle down. Now, it slides in. Instead of this extra mag going in, because like I said, seven rounds and seven rounds. I know it gives you 14 rounds of ammunition. So what we've done is this is a $10 quarter wrapper. It's a bank wrapper. Just put quarters in to take it to the bank. I've kind of squared it off, folded it, and made a little container. I've put 30 22 shells in. 
they're double stacked and it fits nicely right down in where the other magazine was and everything fits back on compact so now instead of having 14 rounds of ammo you have 37 rounds of ammo and in a survival situation you're going to be glad that you had the extra ammo okay remember check out my videos because I do a lot of survival guns uh, different ones I review shotguns pistols rifles you never know what you're going to find uh, might see some that you've never seen before uh, so subscribe that way you never miss anything all right until next time